Hey Spy Ninjas, I just found out that my hacker ex-boyfriend is out to steal Perlita's dad invention! Her dad's the boombox guy! Who would have thunk? And your hacker ex-boyfriend is trying to use this invention for evil because he is a part, part of Project, Project Zargo. Zargo. Okay, we gotta find a way to track down my ex-boyfriend somehow. I mean, the last time I saw him was at the virtual prom and he was about to take off his mask. I know, and we would have seen that handsome face of his. How are we gonna contact him? There's a function on YouTube. It's called YouTube Stories. I've never used that before. It will send it out to everybody. And he must be subscribed to you. Yeah, he definitely watches our YouTube videos. Okay, let's go make the YouTube story. For this YouTube story, you gotta ask him to meet you somewhere. I mean, our usual, you know, at the park. There's a very special tree at the park. It actually shapes like the letter V and Y. Like my name! Perfect! So ask him to meet you at the V-shaped tree. And now you just need to make a message to him. This is your big moment. You gotta be convincing. Hi, X. Boyfriend, I would really like to meet you. I mean, hopefully at a Taco Bell. Oh, shoot. Um, not Taco Bell. Um, Cut! Thief! Uh, that was horrible! I mean, I thought that was a romantic place. At first, I, you know, when you're talking about suave and romantic. Oh, you hang out with Chad too much. Yeah, I kind of have to. I don't know if I can, like, do this whole message thing and be romantic about it. You know, I'm a married woman. It's just weird. I think I got a couple lines for you. This message is for someone special. My Romeo. We had a great night at the prom, but I didn't get to see your face. Maybe you have a chance to show me your face at the park. Meet me by the V-shaped tree, and I'll see you there in 10 minutes, okay? Ready okay. to go to the park? Yeah. Meet right. your ex-boyfriend? Let's do it! Okay, oh let's go. go to the park! Let's go! We're actually gonna meet your ex-boyfriend in real life! I know, I can't wait to see his real face! I know! <laughs> I feel like he's a handsome fella. Oh, 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 oh! Wait, is that him? That's him! That's your Romeo! Oh my gosh! I'm kinda nervous, I'm kinda nervous! This is your time to shine, girl. Okay. You got this? Okay, alright. Thanks for the pep talk. I'll be behind a tree. If you need me, we got our earpieces in. Alright, here we go. I think that's him right there. I haven't talked to him in person before. Only through that virtual prom. Oh, wait a minute. What? Is that who I think it is? I think that's PZ5. That can't be right. Boof? What's going on? Hello, V. I saw your YouTube story to me. I show up to the V that looks like a V. Romeo, Romeo, wherefore art thou Romeo? I am the East and you are the Sun. That was beautiful, but I think you got the wrong message, Foom. I just, I'm so happy. You finally realized we're meant to be, you know? Have you heard of this guy named Chad Wild Clay by any chance? We're kind of an item. We're married. You still like him? That I, loser? He's not a loser. I still like him. I, I love him. I'm way better than Todd. How? I have a nice bow tie. I got stellar personality. And I cook a mean bonus in a blanket. I want to make my own YouTube cooking channel. Ooh. So subscribe to that. Also, you subscribe to me, Queen. Oh. You take your phone. Oh. Turn it this way. You click the subscribe button if it's red and you make it turn gray and then you spy ninja oh thanks mom that was so nice yeah i know i'm a nice guy so the message was for me right you know foof i think this has been a big misunderstanding the message was for someone else so i'll i'll see you around okay Fine. What a weird guy. Regina, Regina, did you see that? That was not him, right? No, it's definitely not Foom. He seems to really like you, V. Makes me feel awkward. <laughs> He's an interesting character. Definitely not your ex-boyfriend. Your ex-boyfriend, from what I can tell from the prom, was kind of hunky. I don't know, do you think he's ever gonna show up? Do you think he even saw the YouTube story? He has to. Someone's coming. Is that him? That's him. That's gotta be him. He's probably tall, dark, and handsome. You know? Oh, no, a true no. hunk. Chad is tall, pale, and handsome. A true a hunk. Okay, oh. sure, sure. Yeah. Yeah. He's looking at the tree. He's making sure it's the right tree. Man, I bet his face looks like Harry Styles. Oh, okay, Regina, focus, focus. Huh? Remember, this hacker here is trying to steal the invention from the boombox guy who's actually Polina's dad and give it to Project Zergo and they're gonna use it for evil. What's he doing? What is he holding? Is that a laptop? Why does he look all sketchy holding it? Oh, he's putting it into that box. That means it's really important. Do you think that's the invention? Yeah, it must be. So we gotta take it back and bring it back to Polina and then she can bring it back to her dad. While you're on a date with him, maybe I could take the lockbox. Wait a minute, Regina. The stealthy spy 
spy skills, that's me. What if you trip or something if you're trying to take that box? That's true. I don't want to ruin all of the plans and then Project Zorg will become successful in our mission. I, I feel like maybe you should do this. Maybe you should pretend to be me. You're the master of disguise. You can be me, right? And then I can be the stealthy one. I'll take the box. I guess. <sighs> I haven't gone on a date. I don't know how to talk to boys. Don't worry, Regina. I'll be in your ear. I'll tell you how to flirt with boys. I mean, I got Chad. You can do it. I don't look like you right now. I gotta get in disguise. I gotta put on my best V suit. I got an idea. All right, Regina. First, we gotta get the look down. We don't quite look the same right now. But I do have this spy ninja jacket, though. But Regina, I don't think our facial features really look alike, though. I feel like people can tell us apart very easily. But you know how this whole virus thing has been going on? I always travel with one of these masks. My mom made me this. Your mommy? I have a spare one for you. I get one too? Yeah. Thank you, Mommy V. Oh, look at that. This covers our face nicely. Let's zip it up. Wow, look at us. Hey, I think I do look like you a little bit. Yeah. How about let's practice some moves. You got to get the spicy spy moves down. First, let's work on the attitude. Be prepared to snap back because you do not take any crap from anyone any man, all right? I'm not bossy, I'm assertive. You gotta walk in this date with confidence. Okay. You know? And then flip. I am a assertive, spicy senorita who don't take no crap from no one. Exactly, you got it. Attitude down, walk down. Just in case there's a battle royale, let's be prepared for a kick. Okay, teach me your ways. All right, let's do a jump kick. It's one of my favorite moves. All right, show me your moves, V. Yeah. Yeah! Can you try it now? Try it with me. It'll be like our special move. I don't know if I could do it alone. Ready, Regina? Yes! Three, two, one, go! Yeah! 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 That's great! I think okay. you're ready, Regina. Okay. Okay, guys, he's waiting for V. Me, I guess, can do this. I am strong, I am confident, and I am spicy. I got this. I am the master of disguise. You can do this. Just be confident and just practice what we did, okay? Let's do this thing. There he is. I think I'm gonna hit him with the walk. The V-walk. Walk, step, step, step. Yes, now, now the hair flip. <gasps> oh! Ouch! I'm okay! Sorry! I'm sorry! I'm okay! Hello. Hi! Is that you, V? Yes, it is I, V Coins! Hello, Governor! Hello, V. Hello! Are you playing a character? Oh no, it's me, V Coins! I don't remember you having an accent. Uh, I'm sorry. Yeah. Oh my gosh, she's completely flopping. Maybe she's just like really nervous. I guess it is her first time flirting with a guy. Would you like something to drink? Okay, sure! Guys, was that smooth? Was that spicy? It's coming. I brought sparkling apple cider. Oh my goodness. How fancy of you. Let me just open it for you. I'd love some apple cider. Oh no. You kind of got on the camera there. Would you like some? I get really gassy when I drink apple cider. But yeah, I'd love some. Just, just going off script. Here you go. Thank you. Oh my gosh, you guys. I think she needs my help. I'm going to phone her in. I'm going to give her some advice here. Oh, I need to uh, go to the bathroom. I'll just be waiting by your tree. Okay, thanks, hacker crush. I gotta get away. V is phoning in right now. Hey, V, what's up? Regina, why are you talking about gas? That's just too much information. I was just being honest. You need to, like, flirt with him. You know, trying to swoon him. You know, gotta be, like, smooth and suave. I thought I was being smooth and suave. V, give me lines to say. I don't know. I'm getting all flustered. Okay, don't worry. I have experience in this. Ask this guy to see his comic book collection. That's gotta work, you know? I mean, Chad has a comic book collection. He's gotta have a comic book collection. All right, okay, ask about his comic book collection, okay. I'm back. Oh my gosh. Are you okay? I'm good. Oh, um, I was just wondering, do you have a comic book collection I could see? I thought we were going to talk. Exactly, I wanna get to know you through your comic books. I don't really have comic books. What? No, 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 that can't be true. All guys have comic books. I never got into comics. I played sports. Who doesn't have a comic book collection? Oh, gosh. Okay, gotta think. Okay, what else? What else? What else? Oh, I love sports. Uh, go sports. Ooh, ask him about what he likes on his tacos. Do you like baseball? No, actually, I love tacos. Everyone likes tacos, right? What's your favorite taco? I don't like tacos. What? Are you kidding me? 
I thought all guys like tacos. I mean, Chad loves tacos. He talks about it all the time. We go there like two to three times a week. Is this guy even my ex-boyfriend? I'm so confused. I'd really like to sit down and get to know you more, V. Why don't we go to the gazebo? Guys, Virginia actually is doing really good right now. They're in deep conversation. So I think this is the perfect time for me to sneak and get that case. Okay. Oh yeah, I really want to get to know you too. And about our past at the GKC school. There's the case right there. This is the perfect chance for me to grab it. Let me just grab something really quick and then we can go. Okay, yeah, get whatever you need to grab. It's just over here. Um, actually, hacker, um, ye. It'll only take a second. Okay, fine. Okay, it's gazebo time. Dang it, guys, V was so close to getting the lockbox, and now he wants to go to the gazebo. I mean, I don't mind spending more time with him. I guess it's kind of fun. <laughs> oh my gosh, you guys, that was so close. I was just about to grab the case, and now they're on the move. I have to follow them. Stealth mode, initiate. Where do you want to sit? The gazebo is lovely this time of year. That was a stealthy roll, just in case you didn't notice. They're sitting down. The only time we had together was at the hacker prom. And then my dumb husband ruined it all. Sorry, sorry, he's not dumb. All right, guys, I think I spot the case. It's underneath that table over there. So I gotta go and sneak in while they're talking. Hopefully Regina is keeping him talking about GKC or my past. So, <laughs> hi. You look very beautiful, V. Really? Wow, I've never heard anyone say that. I like your hair. Really? Thanks. No one ever tells me that either, so, I mean, sorry, yeah, my husband, Chad. It's very pretty when it blows in the wind. Oh my gosh, stop it! Stop! It makes my heart flutter. Oh! Like the first time I saw you at the Gifted Kids Center. Oh, oh, right. There the kids picked on me, but you were nice to me. The kids were mean to you? The first time I saw you in class, I was so nervous I farted. You farted? Yes, and all the kids made fun of me. That's messed up. I, I'm a good person, so I would not do that. You were so upset that the kids were making fun of me that you farted too. Oh! Everyone laughed at you instead. What? That's how we became friends. Kind of like the outcasts of GKC. And we came together while all the other mean hacker bullies were picking on us. Alright guys. Spice girls. Yeah, you know, I, I really liked you when we were in school together. I had a big old crush on you. Can you remind me what you looked like? I mean, you were gonna reveal your face at prom. I am not ready to reveal my face. I got the courage up at the prom because it was virtual, but now we're face to face. What if you think I'm ugly? Oh, you are not ugly, honey. You are not ugly. I didn't suspect the thing. Are they still talking? I've always wanted to know. What is your favorite food? What is Regina doing right now? Is she foot flirting? I didn't teach her that. Why did she learn how to do that? Well, I'm a huge fan of chicken nuggets. They're just so tasty. This is my new lock making kit. Right, guys? Right here. Lock making. Zip it. Every person. Zip it. Lock What was that noise? Oh, I'm sorry. I think it's under the table. Just stay right there. I'll take care of it. I better put this back. I've got to check something real quick. No, 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 no. Look at me. I'm doing a dance. That's a nice dance. Good. There it is. Safe and sound. Yeah, okay. I'm sorry. Oh, whoa. What's over there? Yeah, keep looking. Oh, whoa. That's crazy, isn't it? That was so close. I know. I unlocked it, but you gotta hack it. There's a computer in there. Okay, I'll hack on. You take over. I'll take over. There was nothing over there. Oh, I thought I saw something. So, where were we? We were talking about our favorite food. My favorite food is french fries. I thought you said it was chicken nuggets. He's doing a great job right now, distracting the hacker. Now I gotta take the lockbox and hack onto his laptop. There's something different about you. Oh yes, we haven't seen each other since we were kids. So of course I look different. I'm much, much, much taller now. Let's just talk about something else. Were we ever in detention together? Yes, we had some great times in detention together. Remember that nasty old detention supervisor? He was kind of pleasant. I, did, I didn't mind him. I mean, he wasn't that nice, but not nasty. Uh, I panicked and I just took the whole box. Now I gotta hack it. 
hopefully he doesn't notice that the whole entire box is gone. We were sent to detention because you were showing me how to be good. Wait, we got sent to detention for being good, not for being bad? At GKC, it was good to be bad. So you're saying the GKC school wants kids to be bad? That doesn't make any sense. The Gifted Kids Center's sole purpose was to train kids to be hackers after graduation. Oh my gosh, I never graduated. And neither did Chad. Because we were too good. That's why we never became hackers. That's right, but I graduated. Okay. You know, I don't know if you guys could tell, but I was getting a little flustered out there. Okay, I'll admit it. I think I have a crush on that guy. He said I had beautiful hair. I've never heard anyone say that to me before, so like, that was really nice. Oh wait, I need to step out of it. I'm blinded by his good looks. I need to remember that he is an evil hacker. He stole the boombox guy's plans for some sort of invention he's making, but I just can't help it. His voice, it makes me melt a puddle on the floor. I don't know. I just gotta keep my head focused on the mission. I gotta hack this computer. You were bad enough to graduate from the GKC? Well, after you were expelled, I didn't have anyone to turn to, so I became bad. So if I would have stuck around, you would have been good too? Most likely, and we'd still be together. Then I wouldn't have met Chad. I think it was meant to be then. Can you tell me a little bit more about the GKC school? Like what kind of classes do they teach there? They have all sorts of classes, like how to be stealthy and how to lockpick. Those were your two best classes. <gasps> Wait a minute. Are you saying that I learned my lockpicking skills and my stealth skills at the GKC? For the GKC talent show, you picked five locks in one minute. The headmaster and PZ leader were very impressed. <gasps> what? Okay, I need a minute for this. Please, just, just please stay here. I need a minute. Oh my gosh. Sh 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 Regina, Regina, come in, come in, come in. Oh, wait, v, v, what's up? I'm freaking out here. I just learned that. I learned my lockpicking skills and my spy skills at the GKC, a Project Zorgo school. V, were you a hacker? No, I never graduated, so I never became a hacker. But I'm freaking out here. Project Zorgo must have recruited me when I was a young kid, and they were training me to be bad. But I'm not bad, right? V, focus on the mission. Repeat after. After me. I am a good spy ninja. I am a good spy ninja. I am confident. I am confident. I am assertive. I am assertive. And I am a spicy senorita. And I am a spicy senorita. Did that make you feel better? It really does. Confidence, assertiveness, spicy. Got this. Okay. V, while you're there, just try to get him to reveal his face. You got this, girl. I am back. I kind of have a little meltdown there. I was not prepared to hear that kind of news. But I'm glad to hear that we were such good friends. I feel like I can trust you. You were good just like me when we were kids. So there's definitely a good heart in there somewhere. I think you should come to the good side. And by doing that, you've got to take off your mask. I really want to see your face. Maybe by seeing your face, it will recall back some good memories that we had together. Maybe it will help me remember who I was when I was a young child. You know, I really like to have my best friend back. If it means getting my best friend back, I will take off my mask. Okay, oh wait, you're, you're kind of washed out right now. Can we move over here so for better lighting? He's gonna reveal his face! Oh my gosh, guys, it's actually happening. He's gonna reveal his face. I've been waiting for this since the prom video. And now... We're finally gonna see it. Today we find out if I have what it takes to rejoin the Spy Ninjas. What do you think, Daniel? A couple videos ago, I asked you guys at home, what do you think? Should Melvin be a Spy Ninja again? Or is he still a big old badonka donka ba <laughs> Just tell me what it is. Okay, you guys commented so much. The results are in, baby. Let's take a look. I see some saying no. I see some saying yes. Let me just do my quick little hacking skills and uh, add them all up. Addition isn't hacking. No, it's a script I wrote. You want to sit here and go through all 60,000 comments and get a little piece of paper and write each one? Oh, I was thinking of just looking at the top comments. And ooh, Melvin, I got bad news for you, buddy. 43% said no, they don't want you to be a spy ninja. Well, that means 57% said yes. <laughs> yeah, yeah, that's true. That's true. Still kind of close, though. You know what? I'm not totally convinced either, Melvin. Why? After everything you've done to the spy ninjas, the broken legs, the betrayals, the punches, my bad. <laughs> <laughs> You're bad! Like it was an accident. I'm good now, right? I don't know, Melvin, you have this weird lackey guy following you around all the time. What's that about? Uh, yeah, you know, he's still working on his clout game. He's what you would call a protege. He's a hacker. You're hanging out with a hacker, aren't you? He's not even a hacker! He's just someone who wants to follow in my footsteps and understand my way of life. Which I think you should do, Daniel. I don't think you understand where I'm coming from. 
walk and talk with me, Daniel. All right. What if you walked a mile in my shoes and understood where I was coming from? Ooh, are we the same shoe size? Actually, I don't want to wear your shoes, Melvin. They probably stink. No. You're a sweaty boy. No, thanks. I I'm going to just go back to the safe house, all right? You maybe you need to understand a little bit more about what clout means to me, Daniel. Clout schmout. You're always going on about clout. Clout this, clout that. I don't care about clout, Melvin. I don't care about fame and fortune. I just want to have fun. But if you peered into my soul, Daniel, maybe you can tell me what I need to do to become a good spy ninja. And isn't that worth it? Maybe you can use this opportunity to reverse engineer my thought process. Reverse engineer, okay. I thought you were a man of science. Yes, yes, okay, you know what? If you put it that way, as a man of science, that's a great way to figure this out. If you can actually become a spy ninja or not. Sure, Melvin, I'll figure out what's going in your brain of yours. <laughs> <laughs> well, let's just jump into it. Yeah! Welcome to the Clout for Friendship Challenge. Hey! First things first, you gotta have a sidekick who can help keep you fresh. Oh my gosh, a sidekick? I knew you're gonna invite a hacker, aren't you? A no. bunch of hackers. I've already made a few calls to some of my associates. That sounds like hackers to me. Daniel! Chad, Chad, where are you? Is that your sidekick? No. Oh, speaking of sidekick, yeah, where are the spy ninjas? You're the sidekick to the spy ninjas, Daniel. <laughs> hey, no, no, I'm not a sidekick. I'm one of the main spy ninjas, right? I guess Chad and me did start it. Am I a sidekick? Do you have a sidekick? Someone who keeps you in check? Oh. <laughs> yes, I do, Melvin. Regina? No. I've had a sidekick who's been there for me through thick and thin for the past couple months. My sidekick is... Douglas! Oh, hello, everybody! It's me, Douglas! Not to be confused with Douglas. No, no, no! Not Douglas! You know, I don't know where the real Douglas is, but... This little guy right here, oh, stop man. He's been with me ever since I lost Douglas and he's just means so much to me. He's definitely my sidekick. Ow! Douglas! Bad dog! So this is my sidekick, where's your sidekick? He didn't even show up. Here he comes. Oh hey, hey Melvin, Melvin, ha. <laughs> oh man, it's really, really just really so nice of you to have me come over here and, and be a part of your challenge. That's just gonna be so great. I knew you'd bring a hacker here. Whoa, whoa, hacker, I'm no hacker, okay? I work for Melvin. This is not a Project Zorgo mask. This is the PZ-9 best fighter mask. All right, my lackey dude, you're gonna hold the camera. Cause like I said, you gotta help keep us fresh. Oh, I doubt this guy even knows how to work a camera, Melvin. Look at him. You make sure you got the ISO right? And the focus. He'll be good, Daniel. Just relax. And let's move on to the challenge. All right. If you want clout, you gotta look the part. Are you ready, Daniel? I look the part. Look at me. I mean, I'm, I'm missing my blue shoes. But other than that, I look pretty cloudy. You look more like cloudy with a chance of meatballs. Oh, that's a great movie. I have a crush on the girl. She's not real. Okay. Well, first things first, you gotta have the ice, the bling, the jewelry. Well, I mean, what says bling bling besides two watches? That's kind of bling, but you also have to have a powerful wrist check. And what's a wrist check without some rings? I'm not married, Melvin, like you. I'm not married either. I'm married to the game where I get clout. Oh, you can wear rings without being married? Oh, easy there, like, yeah. Uh, yeah. You could wear whatever you want to without having to be whatever you need to be, right? Wait, whatever. Anyways, I have a whole bunch of rings, Daniel. Whoa. And I figured you should up your wrist check with some blame. Boom, how's that? You know what? You feel it yet? It just does feel pretty cool. I kind of see why you wear rings now. More! Did you bring any for Douglas? Dogs don't wear rings. Well, maybe. Ooh. That's la cool. La. Now his hearing is impaired. <laughs> More. More. Wow. All right, now let me see that wrist check, Daniel. Uh, wrist check, like that? Okay, no, don't draw too much attention to it. Hey, Melvin, you got any rings for me? <laughs> no, what do you think? I am made out of money? Maybe after this you can get a ring pop. Oh, okay, a ring pop. Yeah, I like that. All right, keep filming. Delicious. Let's see a Douglas check. Douglas check. Oh, yeah, boy. <laughs> Uh, I don't know, Melvin. This is kind of cool and all, but I still don't get this whole clout thing. Uh, there's got to be more to it. I think being a spy ninja is a lot cooler than wearing rings. Well, uh, it also increases the damage if you got a battle royale, you know what I'm saying? You also need to have a catchphrase, a one-liner, something cool to say. Like mine. Wrist check. What's yours, Daniel? Oh, how about footlongs? No! I mean, you do intro your videos with what it do, spy ninjas. It doesn't sound like that. It's more like what it do, spy ninjas. Okay, so what do you say when you 
defeat hackers. I usually say, um, uh, wait a minute, I don't think, I, I don't think I've ever defeated a hacker before. What? I mean, I'm sure I must have been in the Spy Ninjas for almost like a year and a half at this point. We've battled some hackers. Ooh, how about, uh, oh! Ankle check. Ew! No one wants to see that. It's the same thing as wrist, but cooler. Well, no, you don't wear bling on your ankles. Well, I got uh, some, some nice fur. Feel it. Feel the fur. It's so soft. Ew! Come on. This feels like get in there. Ah! <laughs> it feels like you could wash your dishes on this. You know, you scrub your pots and pans on Daniel's legs. <laughs> oh, that's a pretty good idea. My ankle check would be way cooler than that, too. Well, why is that, Melvin? What does your ankle have that mine doesn't? <laughs> Let me show you. Ankle check! What's that? I got tattoos, bro! I'm not, I'm not getting tattoos, Melvin. Yeah, it's not for everyone, but it's definitely for me. <laughs> okay, so you're telling me that you think people like you because you have cool tattoos or cool rings or you got a really handsome beard? It's not things like that, Melvin. I think so. If people really loved all that stuff, then explain how come I have more subscribers than you. <gasps> Daniel! Or how about my videos get so many more likes than yours? You got so many dislikes on your videos! Whoa! Look at the clout already getting to his head! <laughs> well, let's change that! Take your phone, turn it right side up, hit that subscribe button, make it gray, and you make my day! Ha <laughs> ha! Gee, sorry, Melvin, what I said back there, I usually am not mean like that. It's all this stuff, I guess, is getting to my head. It's okay! Do a shout out for your channel! You earned it! No, 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 guys, definitely subscribe to Melvin, alright? PZ9 is trying to grow his channel. I respect that. Alright, well, you've done well. Let's move on to the next challenge. The next challenge is physical swagger. If you can look the part, you gotta make sure to act the part. Act the part? Stretch your stuff, Daniel. Let's see it. Uh... Why are you, what are you doing, Daniel? No! I'm stretching! Stretching? That's not even a decent stretch! Let's see your walk! My walk? Your clout walk! I just walk like normal, like this! That walk looks unsure and unconfident! It's just a normal walk! Human beings walk that way! How can you walk possibly different? It's the subtle things that make people think differently about your personality! Chest out, head back, shoulders tall. Looks uncomfortable. The only thing uncomfortable about this is all the people who look at you and feel afraid about your dominance. That's weird. You look like a robot. A clout robot. Another important thing is your landing. Landing? Yeah. When you do a cool jump, you gotta land all cool like. I don't jump that often, Melvin. Let me show you. <sighs> hey. <laughs> All right, Daniel, are you ready? That looked easy enough, sure. Okay, so I just jump off here? Yeah, and land cool. Okay, kind of high. Uh, Not really. Okay, here I go. Cool, land cool. Cool, Daniel, cool. Here I go. One, two, three. Oh. Ah. Oh. Um. <laughs> My ring. <I> did <laughs> he just landed like Sonic. Are you okay? Yeah, yeah, I'm fine. Okay. I mean, it's kind of cool, right? I landed in a bunch of shiny things when no, that means you took damage. Try again, Daniel. Again? Here, let me show you. <sighs> Superhero landing. Oh. To the wrist check. That was pretty cool, Melvin. You look just like Master Chief. Let's see what you got then, Daniel. Ouch! <laughs> what happened? Uh, nothing happened. I'm, I'm cool. <laughs> Did you hit your head in the pole? <laughs> no, no, I oh. clipped my ankle on the slide. Oh, pathetic. It don't matter. Okay, go, Daniel. How's this, Melvin? Hey, what it do? <laughs> okay, I'll take it. That's not bad, Dan. Yeah, there we go. Do you think the spy ninjas think I'm cool right now? Oh, absolutely. I think yeah. right now you're cooler than all the other spy ninjas right now. I am starting to get it. It's pretty fun being a Melvin. But you're not there yet. Let's move on to the next challenge. That was pretty good, guys. Pretty cool. I got a guy. I, I got some no. ideas. For landing? Keep on filming, I'm gonna have to cut all this out! Next challenge! Do you remember my ninja moves for clout system, Daniel? Oh, yeah, I remember that. Crap. It's not crap, okay? Because one of the steps is strength. You gotta make sure you have strength behind all this clout. And in order to get clout, you must work out. Hey, you're a poet and you didn't even realize it. Let's start off with some simple push-ups, Daniel. Push-ups are for babies. Yeah! So for grown adults, 
You're gonna use weighted push-ups. Daniel, if you can lie down on my back. Lie down? Yes. Like booty cheek to booty cheek? Cheek to cheek. Oh, wow. Wow. Nice cushion. I just feel bones. <laughs> and then you get some push-ups in. Ready? Ready. Yeah! Whoa! Yeah! Whoa! Oh, how much do you weigh? Whoa! You weigh a lot. <laughs> <laughs> okay, that's good golfing. Oh, wow. <sighs> You made it look easy, okay. I hope so. You're heavier than I thought. Okay, okay, let's take turns. I'm gonna do some push-ups now. Get on my back, boy. Okay, I'm a big boy. My muscles are big boys, too. Oh. <laughs> are you ready? I have you in my mouth. <laughs> what? <laughs> what is it? Are you making excuses? Uh, okay, ready? Okay, I'm ready. Three, two, one. Ah. Did you start yet? Ah. <laughs> Dude, what have you been eating? All the quarantine snacks. I definitely am feeling the burn. Do I look bigger yet? Is Maybe it? one more workout. Okay. Let's do it! Yeah, some pull-ups, Daniel. Wow. Can you do any? Oh, I'm sure. Looks easy enough. Okay, your turn. Here I go. Uh, Almost. Uh, ow. Okay. Come on. Uh, you got it. Uh, you got it. Ah, uh, 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 man, these rings. They're throwing Daniel. me off. I can't, I can't do it. It's hard. Uh, whoa. Yes! I'm doing it! I'm doing it! Yes! I'm the strongest boy who ever lived. Take that, Melvin. Oh, one, I mean, seven, eight, nine, and ten! Yeah! Woo! Feel that burn, Woo! baby! Feel that burn! I think I did more than you, Melvin. From spotting you. <laughs> Gotta help a boy out, you know. You know, at first it was hard, but with a little bit of practice, it got easier. Practice, huh? Yeah. Talk about practice. What else do you want to do, Melvin? The next step is tie it all together to make a signature move that you use in Battle Royale. You already know my signature move, right, Daniel? Sup! I wish I could do something like that during battle royales, but I usually get kind of scared and I just freeze up and become like stiff as a board. Did you say you get stiff as a board? Yeah, sometimes. That's perfect! Daniel, freeze up! What? The battering Dan! Yeah! Oh. Battering Dan! Oh. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. Oh. 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 How's that for a signature Whoa. move? That would definitely be effective against a bunch of hackers. It's like what the police do when they're busting a bad guy. They bust down the door. Hey, come in or else we're gonna bust down the door. Try it. Bam, bam, bam. I'm glad you're so excited about it. <laughs> that was great. That takes so much energy to do. I know, I'm exhausted. But you're almost there, Daniel. Lackey, you hand over the camera. Okay, lackey guy, uh, go do that thing I told you to do. Oh yeah, uh, the thing. I got it. <laughs> Check out this, I'm gonna walk with my cool walk. Dude, your lackey's weird. Where'd you send him off to? He's gonna go grab something real quick. I think you have what it takes, Daniel. You do? Well, honestly, you've always had what it takes, but now you have more clout to go with it. I do feel pretty awesome now. I got lots of confidence. And I want you to show all the spy ninjas, not just Chad V and Regina, but the whole world. All right, all right. It's time for you to make a clout montage. Yeah! What it do, Spy Ninjas? It's Daniel, the world's best, man. Lately, I've been getting the feeling that a lot of people at home think I'm the least coolest Spy Ninja. Well, let me tell you something. The lie detector test says that's false. Not only am I the best hacker in the group, I'm also an expert drone pilot, a Roblox extraordinaire, and one heck of a musician. Anyways, that's it from your boy. I just wanted to tell you what it do. Wrist check. Yeah, Daniel! Yeah. <laughs> That's how to showcase that clout. Man, I am feeling as confident as I ever have. I'm ready to, to get the views. See, now do you understand where I'm coming from, Daniel? What do you guys think? Leave a comment down below. Do you like the new Daniel more? Or do you like the old Daniel? Please, right? <laughs> See, Daniel, aren't you having fun right now? Yeah, I guess I'm kind of getting a better idea about what's going on in your brain. Clout is okay, I guess. But, Melvin, I still don't forgive you about not being my watch brother anymore, man. That day you beat me up, you took off the watch I gave you. Dropped it to the floor. That symbolized the ending of our friendship. And what is this? It's a Seiko. Yeah, you are quite psycho, Melvin. Ah. And what about Chad? He became your new watch brother? 
you gave him a really cool, like, DeLorean looking watch. Have you moved on, Melvin? Does it make you jealous, Daniel, that I have a new watch brother? <laughs> You're gonna have two watch brothers, right? I just can't believe you, Melvin! You were my watch brother from another mother. Gosh, where is Lackey at? It's taking such a long time. Yeah, I forgot he even left, to be honest. Well, yeah, my arm is getting tired holding this. Dude, dude, look. What, what is that? Look at that, you see that? Yeah. Uh, let's go check it out. Okay. What? Oh, you hear that? Oh, yeah. oh, 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 oh. What is that? You hear that, right? What the heck are you doing? Practicing my cool landing. Did I stick the landing? No. Oh, absolutely man. not. You come out of those slides a lot faster than you think. That's fast? Yeah, you come out of there like a torpedo. <laughs> okay, well, did you do the thing? Yeah. Give me the thing. Okay. And you do the thing. All right, Daniel. What is that? Wait a minute. <gasps> the drone! I haven't seen this thing in ages. Yes, I made PZ Lackey take it from PZ2. He's getting pretty good. Lackey, you took this from PZ2? Ow! Ow! The heck? Something pinched me. Ouch, jeez. It was this right here. The rotor's broken. Look at that. Oh, both rotors are broken. Who you, did this? You broke it. I didn't break it. I got it from that, that clown, PZ2, the dog guy or whatever. I don't know. He must have been chewing on it or something. I don't know. Man! Where am I gonna get a new propeller rotor thing? This is dangerous, man. It is good to have it back. I'm a hacker, you know I'm a tech guy. I can fix these things, but I'm definitely upset. Yeah. Good work, okay? Yeah. Daniel, hold this. Okay, I'm gonna be over here. You know, even though my drone is kind of damaged, I can't believe I have it back. Melvin's actually turning out to be not so bad. I think he really is trying to be a spy ninja again. He's changed his ways. You, wait a minute, am I just being a sucker? Is Melvin tricking me or something? It is kind of cool to have all this bling bling, but I don't know if it really matters. Regina did teach me you should always be your true self. Maybe this isn't the real me. Well, whatever the case is, I think Melvin, he's gonna be on our side in no time. Hey, I made him get us some Subway subs. Footlongs! Subway footlongs? Well, listen, you know, I know the drone's broken, but I, I truly am so happy that's back in my possession. Thank you so much. Do you think I'm ready to apologize to V and Regina when their heart's over? I mean, they didn't go through my transformation, so they might not get you, but I think you're on the right track, yeah. You know, I'll put in a good word for you. I'm sure all the spy ninjas will be on board. I had so much fun today. Cause man, Melvin, I can't imagine going another three months without you, buddy. The last three months have been so rough without you. I'm so happy you're back, man. I missed you terribly. Really? Yeah, I really mean that. I also had a lot of fun too. This was awesome. Today was a good day. Yeah, it's good to have you back, man. Likewise. Oh, Chad's calling me. Hello, Chad? 715 is using the transloser on me. Come quickly. Whoa, what's got in him? He's like, oh, transloser? Transloser. Oh, it's that thing we found, remember? Oh, that blueprint. We gotta go save him. 715 is there? Melvin, what do you say me and you? We go on a mission together. Spy ninjas unite and help Chad, yeah? I got his location right here. He's somewhere up there, Melvin. Go, go, go. Hurry, Daniel. I need your help. It's an emergency. Chad, I go get help. I'll yeah, be back. Good help. Okay. Hurry, Daniel. They're right up ahead. Let's there go. There he is. Okay. Yes, I'm on fire. We got Chad. Chase him, get him, get him, get him! Go, Daniel, go! This way, over here! Hey, wait a second, Daniel! We're surrounded! Oh, gosh. Shoot, you're right! We got you stuck in our trap! And I got the transloser, and I'm gonna use it on all of you guys! Careful, that thing is really deadly, it's really dangerous. You guys don't want to get zapped with that thing. Chad! Yeah. Chad, what the heck, man? Let's get out of here! Wait, wait! It's not working no more! I gotta charge it up again! Aww. You ready to battle? You don't look ready to battle, Chad! What happened to you, man? I'm ready. Let's do this. Kia! Dude, where's his energy? Yo, move out the way. Move out the way. I got my boys here, ready to bow down. You guys ready? Come at me, Daniel. Come at me, Melvin. Better get ready to battle royale. These hackers, they look really angry. This is some fine Kentucky bluegrass right here, but if we see what direction the wind's blowing, looks like it's going this way about seven degrees west, so that means if we... Oh, I've never seen here? a tree. Yeah, yeah, He's so yeah, boring! Yeah. Chad's a joke. Chad's a joke, yo. Yeah. Go 1715. That's it. That's the stuff. Yay! 
yeah, this transloser thing's working real good. Before we battle, make sure your shoes are tied. Chad! What the heck? They were tied perfectly! You gotta battle, Daniel. What the heck has gotten into Chad? Did you hear that, Melvin? That hacker has that transloser we heard about. I think it made Chad boring. Let's go! Let's go! Yeah! Yeah! That's right. Bow down, boys! Bow down? Uh, what am I, a church here? But you're a little small. Yeah, yeah, I'm chill. I'm chill, bro. I'm chill. Maybe you gotta shoot for the sidelines. I'm on the front lines. I'm not the sideline type. <laughs> Get up! Oh, thanks, Melvin. What a gentleman. You gotta hold the camera, because you know what time it is. Tell you what, I'll hold it. I'm quite the cinematographer. Let me see this. Are you sure, Chad? There's no way he's no. gonna help us out with the battle royale. No way, Chad. You gotta send this one out. You're gonna get injured. I am ready to battle. Hoot, hoot. Does this thing have a black and white setting? That'd be really nostalgic, I think. Kind of a noir filmmaking technique, you know? Ah, hey. What is happening? The wild got sucked out of you. Daniel, you know what time it is. Yes, I do. It's time to fight! No! Okay, all right, you can do this, Daniel. It's time to fight, boy, you can do this. Come on, get into it. Oh, yeah, that's right. When you mess with Daniel, you get the Daniel drone. Woo! Yeah! Hey! Ah, 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 hey! Think about that, Stop! Oh, oh. Don't tell my mom, okay? Oh, what the heck? Um, he's just a little kid. I don't care. He's busy squire. What are you? Oh! Oh! Melvin, here. Oh. Dude, we're losing this fight so far. Yeah, I can tell. We gotta work together or something, man. We're split up. That doesn't work. Then we gotta play some duos. Let's go, Dan. Yeah. Yeah, man. Oh. I don't know when to stop. Don't stop, Daniel. Yes. You're doing great, Daniel! You are too, man! Two down, two more to go! Uh -oh. That's halfway. What? You are a piece of me? Well, you have to get through these stun stars. <laughs> oh my gosh. Stun stars? What do we do, man? Hey, to bow down! Hey! Oh! Oh! Ah! Melvin! Oh! No, Melvin! Shoot! Oh, man! What do I do? Melvin's down, but I can't hit a kid! Uh, oh! Hey! PG Squire! The stars for you, Danny boy! No, you know what? I'm gonna tell your mom what you've been doing, sneaking out of the house and getting into fights. I don't care. I don't listen to my mom. I'm my own man. <laughs> your own man, huh? Oh, well, you know what? I'm gonna tell Veronica Kwan Wait, what? what you're up to. Look, That's right. Veronica Kwan? Get out of here, oh, Squire. No, 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 not her. No, 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 don't do that. No, stay, stay. Melvin, Melvin, you okay, man? Get up, get up. There you are. Ooh, okay. Uh, yeah. Oh, there's just one left. But he's the toughest one. Jeez, what's taking you so long? I've been waiting back here all day. Oh my gosh. <gasps> Are you thinking what I'm thinking? Yes, yes. It's Bowling Legend Roy Buckley. No! Melvin, why the heck would I be thinking about that? No, we gotta do our special move, man. The Battering Dan. <laughs> yes! Oh, <yeah. laughs> Watch out, 715! What the heck are they doing? I never seen nothing like this! You're about to go down, 715! Yeah. Oh. Landing style! Oh. <laughs> oh, yeah. Nice moves. Nice one, Melvin. That's about all of them. That'll do it. What do you think about that, Chad? That was pretty thrilling and exciting. Daniel, your shoe's untied again. Let me tie that up. We just had an awesome fight. You care about my shoes? You gotta be safe, Daniel, you know? We gotta bring him back to the safe house before more hackers show up. Come on, Chad, let's go. Let's go. Stay one five, be trash. You are. Melvin, stop. This watch is really too flashy for me, Melvin. Chad is only like a fraction. He's only like a fraction of his former self. He used to be the most oh exciting guy on YouTube. I am still exciting. I'm the most exciting guy on YouTube. Why don't you start off by telling us what in the world happened to you? <clears throat> 
I was going through the park with Perlita and then 715 showed up with this weird device. It kind of looked like Daniel's transducer <gasps> and he pointed it at me, did nothing. Do you remember when we went on that mission with 314? We extracted that dossier from him and Daniel, did you in the vanilla envelope, there was this record of some experiment that the hackers have been working on. It kind of looked like the transducer, but it was called the trans loser. It said that the hackers are trying to make it so when you push the button or something, they the lose bread. all. This bread is expired, Daniel. Their personality and they become bored. It's like his personality just got expired. Maybe it's temporary. Maybe we can do something to shock it out of him. Oh, yeah. We should slap some sense into him. Like, possibly, literally. Wait, what are you talking about? You're not saying what I think you're saying, are you? Yeah, something like this. Oh. No, then that's not cool. Oh. oh, ouch! Daniel, why'd you laugh at him? Oh, hey, hey, hey! Daniel, <laughs> why'd you laugh, Melvin? Oh. Hey, not cool. Hey, what did I do, Melvin? Melvin's fun hey. to do. Oh, hey. hey. Oh! And then poop. Ah! You too. Oh! I don't like this weird chat. It seems like it's kind of working. Maybe we need to do more exciting things to get him back into it, huh? Okay, guys. I need to change my clothes because they're dripping in sweat. Okay. I'll be right back. We sweat all the time in our clothes. Yeah, every day. It's like no matter what we do, we wear the same shirt and... We're in big trouble, Melvin. Yeah! He's not the Chad we know and love. We gotta find a way to snap him out of it. Maybe we gotta put him through a gauntlet or something of things that he really likes or enjoys. Oh. Things that he can't possibly be like, oh, that's cool. He'll be like, oh yeah, that's awesome! You like a Chad gauntlet or a, a chocolate or a Chad lynch. Yeah, his favorite things to get his personality back. Or a Chad Wild Relay. <laughs> uh, yeah. A Chad Extravaganza. Or a Chavaganza. A Chattel Royale. Chad Circus. Jerkus. A Chad Celebration. Chattelation. Can we stop? Yeah, that's about it. I think we're dry on those. Yeah, let's do it. What? Oh my gosh, Daniel. Uh oh. You wouldn't believe this. What are those? And these? And this? This is how I feel right now. I feel comfortable. I live in my own skin in these. I lay down on this carpet, and I just feel like I match the carpet. Good vibes. You've gone from Chad Wild Clay to Chad Mild Clay. Being mild is sometimes the right way to be. I mean, you can't be wild all the time, because if you're wild all the time, you burn too many calories, you get thirsty, then you gotta buy the sunny water. This stuff's kind of expensive, and you shouldn't be drinking this anyway. Did you know that there's magnesium sulfate in this, Daniel? Daniel. And there's salt in here, yeah. so as you drink salt, it makes you more thirsty, it makes you want to buy more Dasani. Oh, Chad. Daniel, what is happening here? Oh, what the heck? The magnesium sulfate. No way, Chad, it's just water. It's fine in a huddle. Man, the old Chad drinks like Mountain Dew and eats all these Taco Bell things and he's complaining about water. Maybe we gotta remind him of like the good old days, you know? Something that gets him really pumped and energetic. That's what he's lacking right now. You know what he loves? What? You know what it's time for? What? It's time to bring the band back together! Yeah, hey Chad! What about we jam out? Yeah! Play some rock and roll! Are you guys down for some smooth jazz? Oh. We might as well try, right? We play some good music, you know, he'll be in good spirits. Maybe that's what we need. Yeah, any kind of music. If he can just like hold the guitar in his hands again or sing, it'll all come back to him. Yeah, music is music. Bands back together, boys. Boy. This will definitely do the trick. Here, Chad. My guitar, thank you. I have to tune it first. It's probably good. It's probably good enough, Chad. Oh, a little sharp. What are we gonna do? I Ooh. Guess just let him tune the guitar. Once he starts playing those chords. Ooh, that's worse. He'll be rocking and rolling, jumping up and down. Okay, yes. Let's make a little music video. Oh, about time. A one, two. Uh. Wait, I'm totally confused. It's smooth jazz. What key is this in? This makes no sense. Too technical. Just let the rhythm flow through your veins. This is what the technical musicians enjoy. I'm ah. not as musically inclined as you guys! Chad! Sh guitar solo. Ah. That's not your st- 
dial? Dad! Here's how it ends. Like it began. Chad will show you. Yeah. Daniel, kick us off. One, two, one, two, three, go. Ah, it's too loud. Just try to join in, Chad. I don't like heavy metal. It's not. It's not heavy metal. Oh, it's my ears. Melvin, you're. It's too loud. You're losing everybody's interest, including me and Melvin's. Maybe if the song has some good lyrics, Daniel, then you guys would like it better. April 15th is my favorite day Because the taxes are done that day Oh no. Taxes aren't the most fun thing But I'm really good at them Schwing IRS You're the best Be Cause my tax refund goes west Cause they're in Washington DC But you know me I live in Las Vegas Which is closer to the sea Of the Pacific Ocean La 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 Okay I've had it! Hey! Oh! Oh! I know how to oh. get Chad back to his original Melvin. self! That's my guitar, Melvin. <laughs> it's my mine guitar. now! Melvin, what are you doing? Stand back! I need my guitar. Stand back, Chad! Right, Melvin, I've had that guitar since I was a child. Do not do anything hasty, okay? Hasty? I thought he said crazy. <laughs> Show's over, folks! No, Melvin, no. Melvin! Oh, you did not. Oh, hey, Daniel. I just witnessed Melvin break your guitar. Oh, yeah. I guess the band's over. That's it? That's it? You know, he's still boring as heck? You don't care that Melvin just smashed your guitar? Well, I was thinking about changing the strings anyway, so it's a good head start. You're not even mad? What? Chad, if somebody did that to me, I'd be so mad. Just a little bit of Gorilla Glue fix this right up. Ugh, uh, I give up! What will it take? What else do we gotta do? Oh, uh, yeah! Your lameness is really rubbing off on us, Chad. This is really how you feel right now? Hey, listen to this. It's Nine Inch Nails. No, 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 stop, 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 stop. No. Sounds more like nails on a chalkboard. We tried everything else. Why don't we just no, no, no. bang him upside the head? No, huh? no, no. There's gotta be more things that Chad loves, right? B235? Let's call Project Zorgo up. Let's bring it to him. No, 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 no. I know something Chad loves even more. Oh, I got a sliver. Taco Bell, Spider-Man, comic books. That'll definitely bring him back to normal. Do you have a tweezers? I have a wooden splinter. That's probably the least of your issues, Chad. Oh, I see it. I'm surprised he didn't mention V and all of that. <laughs> Loves true kiss. Could solve his issues. I mean, yeah, but I never heard him, like, talk about V a lot. He talks about Spider-Man a lot and Taco Bell a lot That's more than that. Uh, well, let's go do that. If smashing a guitar didn't work, they always say a way to a man's heart is through his mouth. <laughs> no, that's through a man's stomach, Melvin. But that's how you get to the stomach, is through the... Ah, oh, his lameness is rubbing off on me, too! Don't blame me, because you don't know the proper way to tell a joke, Melvin. Are we gonna leave that there? Oh. We'll probably recycle that. Bruh! For this next test to get Chad back to normal... Uh, come over here, come over here! Got some of your favorite stuff! I got a little surprise for Chad to wake him up a little bit. Ooh! Chad, Chad, hey, 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 hey! Chad! Come on! Look at this. Do you know what these are? This is the Spectacular Spider-Man issue number 37. At least he didn't forget anything. Doesn't it make you excited though? Spider-Man, right? Spider-Man. Oh. Come on, Chad, say it with me. Spider-Man, yeah! Spider-Man, yeah! Spider-Man! Come on! Jeez. And rice. Maybe forget about the Daniel, comic books. This isn't Spider-Man. This is Planet of the Apes. <laughs> you ape. It reminds me about how much I used to like to be by myself and read comic books for hours and hours. No, 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 no don't Chad. do that. Come on, no. Daniel, do something. Uh, oh, I got a trick up my sleeve, Chad. I'll be right back. This part is hilarious. He said webhead. That's funny. 
Not really, and you're sure not making it seem like it. <gasps> Did anybody say Taco Bell? Ow! Ew! We got your favorite cinnamon twist. The only person in the world who enjoys those. <gasps> Whoa! Oh, what? I've never seen Chad spit out food before. That's too spicy for me. It's really not all over me. But I got something else in here. A triple chalupa! Oh my Come gosh, on. get Come rid of that, Let's go, 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 go. Look at this huge quesarito chalupa it's type of- It's a triple lupa, yeah. Look. Whoa, yeah, look at that. Oh my gosh. I've never seen that before. It's like three chalupas in one. Yep. What See do you have that? to say about that? Oh, no. I hate tomatoes. Uh, Are you trying to poison me, Daniel? It's so spicy. Oh, no. Did we just witness Chad spitting out Taco Bell? This is his favorite food in the whole wide world. And it's not making him excited? <sighs> oh, I got an idea. You love your subscribers, right? Yeah, they're the best. What's more exciting than getting even more subscribers? Isn't that awesome? Yes. You could be like the number one most subscribed YouTuber one day. Yes. Do that subscriber shout out you do and you're all like boom, 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 boom. Yes. Yeah. Okay, Spy Ninjas, if you're a true Spy Ninja like I know you are, take your phone. It's You're probably watching it like this. You turn it this way and that makes the video turn into like a small video up here. Dale, take over. No one's going to subscribe <gasps> with that kind of energy. There's a little button right here. It says subscribe. It's probably red. But if you click it, it turns gray. And then it says subscribe. Let's bring it closer. This part's important. There's no need. Then there's a bell symbol. Yeah, you want to make sure the, the bell has the ringy thingies on it. Back up. Because then it notifies you. When okay. You the video. Yeah. Well, you get the point. Please, Spine and just subscribe for Chad's sake. Help us get him back to normal or something. We need his personality back. Like pronto. Like ASAP. Like right now. This isn't working, Melvin. Just playing an acoustic guitar or eating some fast food or... Or, or reading at old comic books, that's not as exciting as we need to be. Yeah. We gotta go crazy with this, okay? Yeah. We gotta go outside, yeah. do some extreme activities, all right? Yeah. Go to the park, even. Right, Chad? Right. After we clean up, let's head to the local park. That's what I said. Let's, yeah. Okay. The, oh. After we take some wet wipes and we wipe down the counter and sterilize it, make sure there's no germs or viruses. Melvin, keep your camera equipment clean. No! Hardcore! Ow, relax. Yeah. Let's do it. Monkey see, monkey do. Hardcore. Yeah. A dinosaur bone is slippery. Hey, look, matches my pants pretty well. I'm pretty stylish. Oh, Chad. I could probably take a photo shoot right here. No wonder it's having such trouble. Shoes untied. Chad, what the heck? I got this, I got this, I got this, I got this. <sighs> yeah! Oh my gosh. Parkour. Send it. Oh. Oh. Sorry, Daniel. What are you doing? That's my megaphone. Par, 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 ah! Where's the button? Boring chat in a megaphone is like multiplying yeah. by one. Hello? Oh, I put the batteries in wrong. Here we go. Hang on, I got this. I got this, Daniel. Hang on. Test, test. Nope, that's wrong. You broke my megaphone. Oh, <laughs> I get it, I get it. Is this real life? <laughs> Go Daniel. That's it? Go Daniel. Parkour. Oh, yes. Oh, too scared. Parkour. Good job. Parkour. Uh, uh. There you go. There you go. Very good. Ah, oh, my shoe's untied. Oh, really? Are you serious? Parkour is hardcore. It's just, uh, uh, uh weird. Oh, parkour! Parkour! Chad! My shoe's untied. Oh no, man! That's why I slipped. Dinosaur bones are slippery. Parkour! What are we doing here, boys? 360 ball into like a little back roll double leg off that chest into the bushes. 360 ball. 360 ball. Back roll. Ah. Ah. Daniel, you're up. Oh, parkour. Parkour, parkour, parkour. Ooh. 
car, car. My shoe fell off. Hang I on. thought you just tied those. I did. See what happens when you don't tie your shoe? Ow, you get a boo boo. I don't need shoes. This is parkour. You don't need shoes for parkour. You kind of do. Okay. Thank you. <laughs> I think that's enough parkour for me. I think we need to do something a little less exciting. Maybe we should go fishing, Daniel. Fishing is a great sport. It's very thrilling. You take a, a worm, you put it on a hook. Okay. You cast it into the water. He's into his monologue. Get over here. His shoes untied, that's why. Oh, oh, we're at the end of our line. <laughs> fishing, <laughs> fishing, fine. yeah. Are you talking about fishing too? Just give us a moment, Chad. We've tried everything in the book. Yeah. Maybe we should just battle royale him. If I give him a good little hey. punch. You know, absolutely he, not, Melvin. Come on. He almost fell on his nards. And fishing. that. Oh. Hey. Dan, you might have to hold this camera. Melvin, calm down. We gotta undo what the trans loser did to him, okay? Chad's an absolute loser right now. That's what. Hey, that's not nice, Melvin. <laughs> Oh, the batteries. Oh, jeez. Oh, oh, you know how long it took me to put those batteries in? You know how long it took me to put these batteries in? Daniel, what are we going to do? Oh, my God. These are Amazon batteries. No wonder. We can figure out a way to get Chad back to uh, his awesome... It's these self. batteries were made in China. Yes. What does that have so? to do with anything? <laughs> so much of our products today are actually manufactured in China. Yeah. Oh, what's happening? I'm turning into a loser also. We got to try other things. What else does Chad like? He likes fruit chopping, right? Well, he loves... V, I don't know why V hasn't been able to help Chad snap out of this. Oh, you're right. It seems like everything he loves just doesn't work. Maybe we need to put him through everything he hates. Yeah, like cat fur. Hey, Chad, let's get some, uh, hey, Chad. Chad? Chad. Oh. Chad! Ah, oh, the batteries! Oh, my God. He took the batteries! Oh, jeez. Chad! Wait, are, you, are you being serious? He's gone? Chad! No way! No, 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 we were, You weren't watching him? I thought you were watching him! Dude, this always happens! Chad! Uh, oh no! You dunce! It was you! Uh, we, we lost Chad! Chad!